Hey guys, uh, here on day two, chemo three. Uh, I'm making the man bag look great again. Those of you in America, you'll know what I'm talking about. Anyway, um, just down here in Del Mar, what a beautiful day. I'm so thankful to, uh, to be alive. Sorry. So thankful for uh, just a beautiful day. There's, there's beautiful waves out here. I'm a little jealous because I'd love to be out surfing right now, but I can't do that because of this thing I've got on me. But uh, anyway, just a challenge for you guys too. I just uh, recently listened to a podcast by Kerry, uh, Kerry Newhoff, and, his, and he had a guest, uh, Brad Forsman, and he was talking about living a generous life. And I've been talking about some of those things with living a life without regrets and doing something with your life to make a difference. But he had a couple of points that he made uh, that I, I hadn't thought through before, and it was really good. And one of the first ones uh, was being generous in your thoughts. and. He didn't really go into much detail, but that just the idea of, of being generous in your thoughts and what that means. And I just want to, it's a challenge to me personally, as I look around people and the, ex, the expectations we put on people when they say something, when we see them do something and we, we kind of assume the worst of them. And, uh, you know, living in Papua New Guinea for all these years with my wife and three kids, and then we'd have three other families living all kind of crowded together, kids everywhere. We had this idea of uh, you know giving the benefit of the doubt or or giving grace because if you didn't give grace in those situations, pretty soon the families would start fighting and imploding and people go home. Uh, is what happens traditionally. So we made it a point as a team to uh, to live by giving grace to people, and I think this really sums it up: being uh, generous in our thoughts towards others. And I uh, just want to challenge you as you look around you with coworkers. Uh, with your family, with your spouse, uh, you know we're called to to to, uh, to give grace to others, like Jesus gave to us. And so, I uh, just want to challenge you to be generous in your thoughts towards others this week, and uh, make it make a difference in your own life through the, your thought life. Because actions that we do start with our thought life. So, anyway, thanks for your prayers. I'm a little weaker today. My wife says I'm a bit splotchy, but uh, my eyes are a little bit puffy. But I'm here and uh, enjoying the time. My mom's out visiting as well. So enjoying the, the time here and just uh, making memories today. So God bless you guys.